to try to clear away all our snow. So they're lending a helping hand. Love these kids. They're doing it to people who are snowed in and just can't take it out themselves. Yeah, good group of people here. Many of the people they're helping, they're elderly or disabled. Jonathan Hall is in Holden now, live to tell us more about it. John? Good news, right, guys? It's great to see it. This school has a year-round program called Kids in the Community. It's all about helping your fellow man. It sure gives a good feeling because they thank us a whole lot. The Snowden Harris family needs help clearing a path for oil deliveries. And these boys are coming to the rescue. What do you think about this whole thing? <laughs> great relief. <laughs> They're part of a volunteer shovel brigade at Mount View Middle School. They have been so awesome. Their student advisor, Elizabeth Hughes, set it all up. It's really hard work, but you know, it's all worth it to help people who can't shovel for themselves. We were doing the best we can to get out into the community and help a lot of people have access to, to food, to, to visit their families. Just really get out of the house. 60 middle schoolers have volunteered for the program. They've served about 50 families so far, many elderly or disabled. Deborah Johansson Harris broke her leg and can't easily walk or shovel. They're really putting their all into the community and providing a great service, which we really need, especially this winter. This high school junior took part in the program when she was in middle school and now serves as a mentor to younger kids. The only pay satisfaction that comes with helping others. I love seeing their faces when they know that this is just out of the kindness of our hearts. And the teacher hopes this will spread to other schools. We're live in Holden. I'm Jonathan Hall, 7 News.